What's going on today, guys? Today, I'm going to explain to you why you need to determine uh, what length block you're going to use if you are going to run, um, if you're ordering this for the Canic Rival magazines. Uh, when you purchase Canic Rival or Rival S, they out of the box, the magazines will come just like this. They will come with the plastic floor plate, plastic retaining plate, and then they will come with two sets of these aluminum base plates with a little locker. Really nice. A lot of people like to run this on their rival. Gives a little bit more weight when you drop in the mag. But if you are going to do that, you need to make sure you pick the rival option. Because when we see that, we will send you a longer block. And the reason why we have to send you a longer block is because when you break this magazine down, the retaining plate is uh it's a it's a much more uh, substantial retaining plate it's got this raised edge here uh so it makes it so you need a shorter block now when you run the plus zero uh retaining plate and base plate you'll see it's much thinner so it needs a longer block and what we have here is a u19 uh, universal and when we say u19 it means we cut the block so that in this little notch window, it's going to show 19. And what you're going to do, install it into the mag. Take the metal retaining plate, push that down. Okay. Give it a nice tap. There you go. So there, that's how to determine whether you need uh, the standard TP9 series block or the Canic Rival block if you are running the Canic Rival magazines um, and the install. If you have any questions, please reach out to us at magblocks at gmail.com. We look forward to hearing from you. Have a great day, guys. Thank you.